वेलकम टू केमिकोस एकेडमी सो टुडे इस वीडियो इज अ बुक डायबालेज डायबालेज इज अ रिड्यूसिंग एजेंट सो व्हाट इज द फुल फॉर्म ऑफ डायबालेज डाई आइसोब्यूटाइल एल्युमिनियम हाइड्राइड सो वी कैन राइट द स्ट्रक्चर डाई आइसोब्यूटाइल आइसोब्यूटाइल इज CH2 CH CH3 एंड द CH3 1 2 3 4 आइसोब्यूटाइल डाई मींस ट्वाइस aluminium and a hydride h so this is the structure of dibal h h aluminium isobutyl twice so dibal h is a reducing agent which uh, act as a hydride transfer i hydride transfer is from this h hydride transfer is taking place in these reduction reactions as uh, like in lithium aluminum hybrid and sodium borohydride and another important point is this reaction is carried out at a low temperature and absence of air and moisture so uh, when this reaction is taking place the temperature is low temperature minus 78 degrees celsius in the range of these uh, minus 60 to minus uh, 70 uh, 80 something so uh, temperature is low temperature and absence of air and moisture is compulsory and then particularly useful for preparation of aldehydes dibalis is particularly used for preparation of aldehydes and next point esters lactones are converted to aldehydes so lactones nitriles nitriles we can mean c triple bond n group nitriles amides r c o n r dash this is amides amides are converted to imine when hydrolysis is taking place and it is further converted to aldehyde so first it is converted to imine and then alkynes can be converted to e alkene you know e and is an alkene e means opposite side the larger groups will be on the opposite side so e alkene The, these are the important points regarding dibalis. Dibalis is diisobutyl aluminium hydride. The reaction takes place at a low temperature and absence of air and moisture, and particularly useful for preparations of aldehydes. And esters, lactones are converted to aldehydes or lactones. Nitriles, amides are converted to imine. When adding water, it is further converted to aldehyde. alkyne are converted to e alkene so these are the points of dibalage let's see the mechanism of dibalage now to the mechanism so i am going to explain the mechanism behind ester is converted to aldehyde using dibalage so first we will take ester ester is simple ester r c double bond o o r dash this is ester and adding dibalage what is the structure of dibalis aluminum diisobutyl and the hydrogen so this is dibalis and we know aluminum is a lewis acid here aluminum act as a lewis acid lewis acid means it can accept electrons from where it will accept electrons from lone pairs of oxygen so oxygen will donate its lone pairs to aluminum's orbitals and they will form a bond so we can write r c double bond o plus oxygen got positive charge the donated electrons aluminum isobutyl and the hydrogen o r dash so this is the structure aluminum got negative charge and uh, aluminum should not be negatively charged it is unstable aluminum is a positive metal so hydrogen is attached to carbon in carbon a hydride transfer h minus hydride transfer take place this h is attached to carbon in carbon so what will we get r c h this hydrogen is attached to carbon in carbon o r dash and this electrons will shift to oxygen so oxygen uh, positive charges neutralized and aluminum also 
neutralized charge is neutralized i b u twice so this is the structure we will get after hydride transfer now what will happen a hydride as in hydrolysis is take place so in this mixture in this medium a water is there we have water so these lone pairs these water's oxygen lone pair is transferred to aluminium so what will we get r c when aluminium accepts electrons this bond is break and these electro shifted to pu and o r dash is eliminated with hydrogen one of the hydrogen so o r dash h that is an alcohol alcohol is formed and here what will we get r c double bond to h this is aldehyde so the mechanism is first we are adding dipolar to a ester so the lone pairs of oxygen is donated to aluminium so orbitals vacant orbitals and they will make a bond and after hydride transfer to uh, carbon to carbon then we get a uh, this structure and as in hydrolysis takes place so lone pairs of water oxygen oxygen in water is added to aluminium and this compound will eliminate and form rc double bond to h rc double bond to h is aldehyde so we can uh, we can get Uh, prepare aldehyde from esters using esters using dibalage so this is the mechanism of dibalage now we can solve some problems also so in first example the functional group is ester c o o p t ester so we know ester is converted to aldehyde so this ester group is converted to aldehyde o oh. this is a protecting group and the coo ed is converted to cho and we have and in this second example this functional group is cyanide cyanide is also converted to cho cho the double bond is not affected and third example this is lacto lacto o c double bond o this is a lacto so we know lacto is converted to lacto i already said in introduction of this video lacto is converted to lacto ol in fourth example this is a special case this is alpha beta alpha beta unsaturated carbonyl compound so when alpha beta unsaturated carbonyl compound is given adding dibal h dibal h we get a alcohol instead of aldehyde so so the product is not aldehyde it is alcohol so co2 et is converted to i am writing here c n b o c the double bond is not affected and co2 it ester is converted to alcohol c o h ester is converted to alcohol and in fourth example this is alkyne alkyne we know alkyne is converted to e alkene So I will write here C four H nine C triple bond C H. This is the question. So when adding dibalage to this alkyne, we will get a E alkene. C four H nine C double bond C. Here aluminium isobutyl is isobutyl is added. Now it is given I two and H three O plus. I two and H three O plus. So when adding iodine, what will happen? A uh, E alkene substituted E alkene is formed. Iodine will substitute in this place. So this is a E alkene. E alkene. We can write this as 
C four H nine H. So this is an E alkene. So these are the points regarding dipolar. I think I covered important points in dipolar. If any of the points is left, please comment after this video.